Hello, this is a video on how to perform an online channel list update on the Evo Xfinity. What you will need. You will need your Evo Xfinity, a USB stick formatted to FAT32 and although you can use your remote for the purpose of this video, I will be using a USB mini keyboard. This just makes typing on the receiver a lot faster and easier. You can buy these from our Larvatronics online stores. So, the first thing we will need to do is plug our USB stick into our receiver and power it on. When you've done this, you will need to make sure you are on this menu and go across to System. Then select File Manager and here we will need to select Add Source. It will then take you to this menu and you will need to press OK on the remote control. Here we will need to type HTTP colon forward slash forward slash www.fix4.com forward slash Xfinity. You can do this by using the remote control and the on-screen interface, however we find it easier to type if you have a USB mini keyboard. You can purchase these from the Larvatronics online stores. Right, now we have typed this in, we will need to press done and you will see this media source is called Xfinity. For now, we are going to leave it named as this, however you can call it whatever you'd like. When that's done, you will need to select OK. Now that's finished, we will need to go into the USB directory, so go across to the left and press OK on SDA1. This is our storage device. Now that we are in the root of the USB stick, we will need to go back over to the right hand side of our screen and go into the Xfinity directory in which we created. Here we can see the latest channel list folder. Select OK on this menu and then highlight tvdata.tar gz and press the menu button on the remote control this is the button that looks like a piece of paper however here is a picture for your reference once you have pressed this go down to select copy these files and select yes this will then copy the channel list over to your usb stick as you can see over here the next process is to exit from this menu and go to live tv Here, press the right arrow key to bring out this menu and go to Live TV Settings. Once you are here, you will need to press the blue button on the remote control and select Channels Restore and then Yes. And there you go. You now have a new channel list updated on your receiver. If your new channel list looks like this when you first load it, all you have to do is press the red button on the remote control and it will bring up all the favourite categories where you can view your channels. Whenever there is a new channel list online, all you will need to do is go back into your Xfinity directory and the new list will be available ready to download. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. Be sure to subscribe to our channel and give this video a thumbs up. You can now follow us on Twitter.